Hello guys, today I'm gonna show you how to jailbreak the PlayStation 3 with an iPhone 3G. I installed the PS Freedom on it. Now I can show you the method. Switch the iPhone off. You must first ins install the PS Freedom. Well, now prepare. Connect the USB cable of the iPhone in the PS3. Just the iPhone only, nothing else. Well, or it won't work. Then switch the iPhone on and you are in the open iBoot first switch on the PSG from behind and leave it there now connect the USB in the iPhone go on Android and click this button now when you see in it press the restart button on the PS3 and quickly press the eject button Okay, it is loading. Okay, now. And as, as you see, it worked. Here is the app underscore home PS3 game. And here install package file files. With this, you can install homebrew packages. Now I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna install the backup manager and, and the FTP server. Now, when it is on, you can connect the USBs. So, let's connect this USB that it contains the backup manager and FTP server. Let's connect it with the PS3. Okay. First, be sure when it's done, disconnect the iPhone or the PS3 won't see the other USBs. Disconnect the iPhone and then go to install package files. Here is the FTP server and here is the backup manager. First, we install the backup manager. So, complete. So, now we install the FTP server. So, complete. Here is the FTP server and here is the backup manager. We enter in the backup manager and try to rip our first game. Okay, disclaimer, just click yes. 
Here is the backup manager. Now I'm gonna rip this game. You can see it's a real Blu-ray disc. Okay, we we'll go on it, and as you can see down there, it says X to load it and zero to backup. We are going to rip this game in the GD, so we're gonna back up. Press the zero button. Okay, yes. And now the game is backing up. Well, this process will take a bit long. For now, we pause the video and when it's done, we'll, we'll play again and show you how this looks like. Bye for now. Okay, here as you can see, the the backup is, is ready, it is ripped. Now, the upper one is the original one on, on the Blu-ray. You can confirm this by watching down there. It says X load zero backup. Now when we go on the ripped one, you can see X load triangle delete. So this is the ripped one. Now I'm gonna I'm gonna swap the Grand Theft Auto 4 disc with Assassin's Creed disc to see you can load. Grand Theft Auto for backup with the with any you any Blu-ray. Okay, as you can see, the game is out. The game is out. Leave it there. And now, just on the screen. Okay, it's on screen. X load zero backup. So this is the Blu-ray and J4 X load triangle delete. First I'm gonna load a screen to show you this is the real screen. X. Now I'm gonna load GTA 4 via Sin Screen. We enter our manager again. Yes. We go on Grand Theft Auto 4. Press X to load. And now the Blu-ray drive is emulating Grand Theft Auto 4 via um, Assassin's Creed. We go on it. It says it is Grand Theft Auto 4. While in fact it is Assassin's Creed. We press X. And you can see it starts. It is loading. The PlayStation 3 is officially jailbreaked and can run backups finally. Thanks for watching. Bye.